Dashboard Overview. The dashboard is what you see when you first log in. It consists of your accounts, transactions, and dashboard widgets. Adding an account to dashboard. Accounts are shown on the left-hand side of every page. Accounts at your financial institution are automatically imported into PAM. To add an account from a different financial institution, click on the Add button and follow the on-screen instruction. At any time, you can click an account and be brought to that account's page. From here, you can view transactions for that specific amount, edit the account info, or remove the account from PAM. Editing transaction tags on dashboard. To adjust the tag on a transaction, click the transaction to view it in the transaction editor. You can now retitle the transaction or adjust the tag. If you would like to use the title and tag for similar transactions, create a rule by clicking the box below. You can choose which accounts and what dates the rule will apply to. When you finish, save the transaction. Customizing Widgets on Dashboard Widgets provide a quick overview of the sections of PAM. Each widget has a link to the section it corresponds to. To add a widget, Click the Customize Widgets button below. Select a widget from the list and then click Add. Your new widget will appear at the bottom of the widget section. To remove a widget, click the X in the upper right hand corner of the widget. You can always re-add it later. To reorder widgets, click and drag the widget to the place you would like. Searching for transactions on Dashboard. To find a transaction or filter your transactions list, type a search term into the search box. If the basic search isn't detailed enough, use the advanced search on the right to find the exact transaction you are looking for. You can search by keyword, tag, amount, date, and you can also filter by account using the split tag function on dashboard. If you make purchases at the store that can be split into multiple tags, the split tag feature can be used. In the transaction editor, click the use split tag button. Then apply tags and values that add up to the transaction total. You can auto-fill the remainder easily.